Okay, so our window is resizable, so we can resize the window, but the cube jumps to the lower left corner. That's because OpenGL still uses this 800 by 600 space on the screen or on the viewport. So I'm gonna define um, two new variables, windows width and windows height. Hey, yeah. And this will be 800 by 600. And I'm doing it on one line. So this will be here and this is going to be here. So the less the next thing is create a callback function or I'm, I'm just going to show you one other one thing before I'm going to define that callback function. If you don't want to resize the window, you can set glfw that window hint window hint and glfw dot resizable yes to gl false. So now the windows it window will be not resizable. So as you can see, I can't resize this. So I'm gonna comment it out and just show you how to do. Uh, so, so define the callback function. Window resize and it will take three arguments the window itself, the width, and the height. And uh, set the GL viewport. GL viewport zero zero. This is the lower left corner and the width and the height. So uh, I defined the. window resize function it will be a, it is a callback function and we will call it from the glfw that set 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 I don't see it set underscore size size set window size callback yeah set window size callback and on the window and the callback function is window resize window re resize Okay, now whenever we resize the window, GLFW will call this window resize callback, which is defined here. So now, if I resize the window, the cube gets 
uh, the viewports get gets resized too. So it's no more jumping to the lower left corner.